Yo, 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 what's good everybody? It's your boy B. Woods here with another quick 10 at 10. Happy Sunday morning. Hope everybody's having a great Sunday morning. Get on up, brush your teeth, wash your butt, get them go to church. Amen? Amen. All right? Now, I'm not going to be on before you long at all. Um, I just want to come speak from the heart. Um, basically, what's been on my heart lately um, is the uh, results of having a simple conversation. Let me say that again because my bottom lip got in my way. <laughs> Sitting down, having a simple, honest, clear conversation can clear up so much uh, confusion, so much animosity, so much discord. Uh, just sitting down, chopping it up can definitely clear up a lot of that mess, all right? Um, I had the opportunity to have, um, I talked to a lot of people this weekend. Uh, we had the opportunity to do a couple events, um, we did a photo shoot, did a football game um, and we also did a 40th uh, church anniversary so again congratulations to that church um, that we went to and celebrated with them um, but in the midst of uh, yesterday um, I noticed a lot of people um, I noticed a lot of the conversations that I was having um, one conversation in particular there was a lot of, uh, there was a misunderstanding and a simple, honest, clear conversation cleared up a lot of confusion that was going on uh, on my behalf. Um, and then sometimes, guys, sometimes, you know, like when you're having in these, you know, relationships with people, a lot of times, um, when the communication is not clear and it's not uh, clear, uh, a lot of things can be assumed. All right, and we all know what they say when you assume. All right. So again, a good, clear conversation can clear up so much uh, confusion, so much unclarity. Um, a lot of times, some people are just mad and upset because they are unclear about. Where that relationship stands. Um, had a conversation with um, somebody during a photo shoot, um, and just you know, just confide, confiding in one another. It's important that you, uh, you know, learn who you can talk to. Certain conversations ain't for everybody, um, and sometimes you ain't got to tell everybody a bit. That's basically what that conversation came out to. A situation, something happened. A lot of people don't know because it's really none of their business. They don't really need to know, all right? Um, find that special person or that special group of friends that will hold you accountable um, hold you and hold you to it. Um, shouts out to um, Coach Tyree um, and the Life Lions, the football squad. Uh, what a game yesterday! That's all I'm gonna say. They took the they took the dub yesterday. Uh, they ended up winning 14 to zero. Um, in his situation, <laughs> a clear conversation, um, and I, I hopefully I'm not stepping out of bounds, coach. Um, but the organization did not effectively communicate the game schedule on yesterday. Um, so they were supposed to play at 11 o'clock. Um, the team got there about 9.30. You know, of course, the warm-up, getting ready for the game. They got to the game. The organization says that your game was pushed back to 1 o'clock. So, what does that mean? Those kids had to sit out there in that hot behind sun yesterday. Only because of lack of communication. Nothing on Coach Tyree's uh, part. But it was lack of communicating from the organization down to the coach. And it's a lot of mess that was going on, you know. Shouts out to them. So shouts out to um, the, I think it's 10U or 11U um, tackle football. Harney County guys, check out Coach Tyree, man. If your boys want to play some tackle football, check them out. Great organization. Um, it's not all about football with that organization. He teaches them life skills. Um, he's, a, he's a close personal friend, so I do 
endorse um, his program, man. Um, letting the boys come out and play some football. Shouts out to the uh, the ladies too. They were out there with the cheerleaders as well. So shouts out to those um, ladies as well. I'm looking forward to a great season uh, with the Life Lions. But again, and that too, lack of communication. Communication. A simple phone call could have saved them boys sitting out there in that hot sun all day. Cause it was hot this night. All right. Um, and then I'm gonna hear the last conversation um, we had um, was after the. F- 40th church anniversary um just recapping um how everything went that night so talking with the band talking with um some of the other guys and it was pretty pretty dope just to be amongst that circle last night those guys know who i'm talking about so i ain't gonna shout everybody out but shouts out to you guys the conversation that we had last night guys basically was about accountability you got to find that circle that's going to hold you accountable like and hold you to it, you know. Um, you can confide in certain people and stay right there and don't go nowhere else. got to find that, that little circle, all right? Um, so sometimes that's all it takes. You got problems at the house? Simple conversation. You got problems between you and your kids? A simple conversation. Maybe a text conversation. Sometimes that's how I get through to, to three or four is through a little simple text. But let's do that. A simple conversation. A simple conversation between an old friend. A simple conversation between a lifelong friend that somewhere down the line something got crossed up and mixed up and I didn't no longer talk to you. A simple conversation. Alright. But you gotta be, you know, man enough, woman enough to Sometimes you have to take the initiative and start the conversation, all right? So that's pretty much it. I know it's not, you know, your normal 10 at 10. It's a little shorter, all right? But I think I think you get the picture of what I'm going at today, all right? A simple conversation can, um, let me make sure I read it, what I, what I said on Facebook. A lot of people chimed in on this. Thank y'all for chiming in, too. But a lot of people, I mean, a lot of things can be, Oh, I said, it's amazing. It is so amazing what a simple, honest, clear conversation can do. And it was it was a much needed conversation. All right, so thank you. Y'all, the people know who I'm talking about. Thank you for those conversations. Simple and clear, straight to the point. All right. So other than that, man, it's your boy B. Woods. Another quick 10 to 10. A little quick little plug. If you're not busy... Um, next weekend, um, you know, come, come be safe, come do the COVID and everything, but, um, man up 2021 turning point, September the 4th, 2021, four o'clock, um, got a great, I think I'll throw it up in there. I don't know if you can see that. Right there. Alright, so man, that's the fly right there. I know that guy's right there. Oh, I ain't sure y'all like that. <laughs> Alright. But shouts out to everybody. Alright. But well, we good, man. Alright, so that's your boy B Woods. Another quick 10 to 10. Um, yeah, that's it. Simple conversation. <laughs>